Okay guys, I'm gonna show you how to create simple Windows Media Player using your Android Studio, actually some little bit of programming. So three simple steps, copy the audio files into a resource file, you activate the Media Player, then on Click Listener now you activate, you pull up your song now. So these are the codes actually we're gonna use. So calling music audio, we'll be using Media Player, then create, then this is the name of the song. Same applies to start music, you'll be using this function, so you will set a variable mp.start, then pausing, it will be paused. That's how it works. So getting back to the business. So this is my source code here. So I'm going to show you how at the end, actually what you're going to get actually after writing the code behind, behind our Android Studio. So I'm going to play this. So upon running my Android Studio, I'll show you how it was the final output because, okay, fine, I have my playlist here. So I've created for sample two, so we'll finish up with the other two so we can see how it's simple we can create this using Android Studio. So for instance, you just need big speakers now and I'll try something and your earphones if you have them so i'll play and pause and play okay let's get back to the business now so i'm gonna close this let us put some codes around so that we can play other songs using our win favorite windows media player so the first things first actually i require to copy the audio then activate then on click listener so i know where my audio files are i'll copy this first then copy then paste it in my raw resource file here then paste so i'll label this sound three because i have two on one and two already so there you go there you are then i'm gonna copy another one which is this one here paste it again here so this will be sound sound four there you are okay so having this already you have already four so you're gonna go to the to our source code now here so yeah we label we give them the id so this is how it is so this is the do the same thing actually the id is rupee and the bongo salam is b-o-n-g-o -O. so going to the main activity i have it already here i have it already here so now i'm gonna write a code for these buttons so i'll start with rupee sound number three then start yes there you are equals to button find viewer d D dot rp, yeah, there you are. And then copy this one because this is the the I mean the function which you call your audio, the song which you're going. So this is now because it's two already, so it'll be three. Then from there you just activate on click listener. So I'll start this one. Dot set on click listener new view click listener there you are so i'll activate mp so it becomes three dot start there you are so i'm i'm done with this rupee so i'm going for another the last song actually called bongo so i'm commenting this is commenting actually there is some so i'm starting again small b actually because the, because of this one here small b see then is equal to button yes there you are find view by rd r dot id dot there you are and close using our famous semicolon then copy this as usual so this becomes now sound four so yeah there you are so this will be four and yeah and this one will be three now yes so thereafter this this becomes four yes yes there you are then activate set on click listener so i'll start with bongo dot set on click listener new view click listener so mp4 now dot start there you are so now i've already started so because this is my command of starting now i want to pause them after playing them so that you can be able to be paused so I'll go back to my pause button, which is an image button. I'll call them the, the new added songs m3 dot pause. Then the fourth one also dot pause. Yes, we are done. See, so now prepare your big speakers. If it's Beats by Dre, or if you are, if it's a Bluetooth speaker, you just be ready because you're gonna make a disco here right now using your just simple source code. Okay, then I'll run now my source code. Actually, my my Android Studio, my Windows Media Player, okay. Yes, now it's opening. So it's AK Simple Audio Player. So now I'm gonna play the next song. Yeah, 
Yes. To enforce, you see? So because I don't have a stop button, so actually I need to close it again so that I can play the, the other song. So I have, okay, now I'm gonna run again my my code so that you can play another one. So you see, you can enjoy your music actually using a simple source code Android. So this is just a simple one, a basic one. Okay, then I'll play. Then I'm closing again. Then I'm gonna play the last song actually. The last song. So last song, I'm gonna run again my Android Studio source code. So this is it. So this is the last. So you can create more and more songs actually. So wow. Yes, there you are. I'm gonna activate. Yo, 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 Dania Bongo, Mango Super Pano Bongo, Ingawa some time bongo, chungu kama si fongo. And if I am a karate, come on my chingo tava congo, and I can tindo tindo na cut and give even team and yongo. A fan of a tata ki to rain a pendum tapata, bongo the rest of an impeto bakuta. See, then you can add that. Men of the colour of your bongo star job now, Peter sleep way. Okay, so this was just a simple actually demo on how to do a simple audio. So you can actually calling this media player, you can also set up on your button click so you can put a certain song or uh, audio. For instance, you can play something, you can play, you can play any song, your favorite song. So this is just a beginning for Android. So just a simple coding, three simple steps as I showed you earlier. That means you can always be a programmer just by just creating your own audio player. So this is just the beginning. Thank you. I hope you have enjoyed it. Actually, the source code will be in GitHub, so I'll share the source code for free. So you can start by developing because you're still learning.